Hi, Dean Casmento here. I can't tell you how important it is to be able to manage our own personal expectations on ourselves. I've uh, I've worked with hundreds of clients over the over the many years, and um, there's been some common themes that I uh, often find when identifying the root cause of the reasons why people are at that stage of their life living a certain uh, living an unfulfilled life, and a lot of it's to do with trying to motivate themselves in doing something that they're not inspired. Um, inspired to do or that they're, that they're not really um, motivated to do because it's directly related to the fact that they actually don't value what it is that they're trying to achieve. So, you know, a, 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 an example would be, and I, I've said this in some of the previous videos, an example would be, you know, come New, Year, come New Year's Eve time, you know, you have all these people that set themselves these New Year's, New Year's resolutions. Um, you know, whether it's to quit smoking or to lose a certain amount of weight or to join a gym or to, um, oh, I think the list would go far and wide, really. And then if you checked in on, if you checked in on any of them, uh, any of those New Year's resolutions within a matter of a week, sometimes even a couple of days, you know what, even the next day or even the, even the, 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 the two hours post waking up uh, on January 1st, that the resolution is already broken. And I think it comes down to managing, it really does come down to managing expectations, our own personal expectations on ourselves, which are directly related to our higher values in life. And, you know, I, I still want to sound like a sort of a, a, a record that's broken about, you know, finding out what it is that you really value. Because I think once you find out what it is that you really value and spend your time prioritizing goals, outcomes, and tasks to that, you then start to live the, each day as, as a day of fulfillment. And then you also identify if there are certain areas that, that you want to be uh, motivated by or inspired by. Um, when, you, when you find out what your high values are and you realize that it's actually not even there or it's not part of the, it's not part of the top three or four or five uh, highest values in your life, it allows you to sort of consciously acknowledge that no wonder you're not going out and following through with with the shoulds, you know, and you know that word shoulds and have tos and musts and you know if onlys and all that sort of stuff. They're all little, they're all little language, little markers uh, or uh, you know language patterns that we use or types of language that we use that. Uh, identify it, obviously for me personally that, that, that sort of bit of a red flag for me that indicates that that the decisions that they're trying to make aren't ones based on something that they've that they've well thought through nor are they ready to ready to make so manage your own personal expectations firstly get super super clear on what you really value in your life so what your higher values are um, you know one way to do it there's a couple of ways to do it, but one way you can do it, could, you, could, you could simply ask yourself, you know, in the context of my life, what's important to me? You know, what is really important to me? In the context of my life, what is really important to me? And get a list. You know, you might ask yourself three or four times the same question, and your list might be 10, 15, 20, or 30. And then what you then do is go ahead and start ranking your list from most important to least important. And then you might come to a certain conscious realization that no wonder you're not doing X, Y, and Z that you thought you should do because you actually don't value it. So why would you possibly even do something you don't value? And so that could be a bit of an aha moment for you also. Uh, another way to do it is to, is to um, use Dr. John Demartini's uh, values clarification process. You can find that on his website at www. I think it's johndemartini.com.au or it may be www.demartini.com.au and uh, download his PDF and answer his 13 questions. Um, I think that's a really, really, really valuable process. In the event that you that there are areas that you really want to experience a greater level of satisfaction, fulfillment, achievement, and you want to start setting goals towards the attainment of satisfaction in those areas, remember, start thinking about the real value. So what is the value 
of you achieving of you achieving a certain level of or of you achieving fulfillment or for you achieving the goals in this part of your life and what's the real value for you what's the real benefit what will this get what, what will these outcomes or what will this benefit get for you and how are these outcomes or these benefits related to the things that you really do value right now uh, in the context of your life and uh, 90 to 100 percent of my clients their number one value the number one value is their family so if you start linking those things that aren't so important, for example, those things that aren't so important to, the, to those things that uh, really are important, you'll start to notice that with time, that your own personal inspiration will start, to, will start to increase and you'll start doing things unconsciously to start supporting um, those areas that aren't as fulfilled, but will be more and more fulfilled with each and every day you start thinking about the real value of those areas in your life that you don't value as much just yet. And this is all tied up to managing your own personal expectations. So I hope you found the video um, handy. Uh, if you have any questions about values, if you have any questions about how to identify or, or find out what your real values are, um, also, probably more importantly, is how to identify conflicts and strategies and processes used to be able to eliminate them and let them go and for you to be more and more resourceful inside so you can live that life of inspiration and that life of fulfillment, jump onto my website at www.deancasmento.com.au or shoot me an email at info at deancasmento.com.au. And if I don't see you, I'll uh, look forward to hearing from you shortly. Take care. Bye.